So our investment in Sheffield is in the West Bar development scheme, which is a regeneration of uh, a part of the city centre just north of the core city centre. And it's, it's a really interesting area. Historically, you had the northern industrial quarter in, in Kellam, which is where you had all of the industrial manufacturing of the steel industry and the steel finishing industry. And what we've tried to do is take this area, which became very much you know, industrial hinterland sort of post the decline of the industrial era and bring that back and knit it back into the city centre and create uh, a whole new area where you can have jobs and people living, working in its own sort of ecosystem. So the reason we're investing in Sheffield is part of Legal and General's national strategy to invest in inclusive capitalism, to try and, and bring forward and regenerate towns and cities across the UK. In, in the case of, of West Bar, we have a, a local developer, an urban regeneration specialist called Urbo, uh, who owned the majority of, of, of the West Bar site. Um, and Sheffield City Council, who were sort of key partners in wanting to bring forward this area of the city to regenerate it and knit it back in to those two established areas either side of it to the north and south. West Bar Square is a massive confidence boost for our city. It brings 650,000 square foot of office space accommodating 6,000 workers and 348 homes, all set within great public space. Legal and General are a perfect partner for this scheme because of their experience and resources in delivering projects of this scale and nature. The reason Legal and General were the party that could bring this forward was our sort of unique investment structure and, and, the, and the capital that we can bring and that, that ethos of, of patient capital where we can invest that money for the medium term, it's not quick in and out and that I think is, was really attractive. What we're trying to do is to help build the different, the different sort of neighbourhoods around it and build them back up to actually make it a, a really sort of sustainable top 10 UK city and I think the combination of all those different things with the kind of quality of infrastructure that we're helping to build there will 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 change it for the future generations. Mm -hmm.